Traffic is starting to heat up and there's an interesting contradiction today. Red Robe Astrology for June 28th. It's really all about the masculine and feminine principle of the difference between doing and the being. The, the actions we take and the way we need to contain the choices we make until we're ready to take action feminine principle. It's Mars and Venus in a sextile that makes us in really good working order with that today. We've got masculine principle and feminine principle in the most productive geometry there is. This is great for passion, good sex, creative expression, uh, strenuous pleasure for those of you who like to run or work out. Great day for that. But perception is everything, kids, and Mercury's in a bit of a shit show today. There's a square from the Mercury and Cancer to Chiron. Remember, Cancer's all about memory and the past and family dynamics, and Chiron holds the wounds, and this is conflict geometry. So we're thinking about, talking about, perceiving the wounded spaces today. And then there's a semi-square from Mercury to Jupiter. They say there's no such thing as a Jupiter, a bad Jupiter transit, but this is... Uh, a friction that makes things over the top in a way that can be problematic with the other setup. Um, so, confidence might be in the room, but your uh, confident opinions might be false or overblown or vice versa coming at you uh, with too much, a little bit extra. Uh, also overnight at 1.51 a.m. Pacific time, the moon moves into Aries. So we're a little bit on fire. Mars rules the day. So while Venus is in there saying, please lean towards the feminine principle of waiting and holding and resting and, and preparing, uh, uh, the moon in, in Mars' side will have us wanting to take action. Now, <clears throat> lovely, some lovely lunar aspects. A sextile to Jupiter means we're going to feel expansive and confident. A sextile from the moon to Pluto gives us a sense of power and empowerment. A conjunction from the moon to the north node means the world is cooperating to help you get done what you need to get done today. And we're in the third quarter moon. The moon and the sun are squaring each other. Even though there's this wonderful energy, we're also a little bit out of sorts between our inner and outer experience. The third quarter moon is where we're expected to bring our A game, bring our the wisdom we've just learned. So it's a it's an interesting day. When in doubt, lean towards the sort of feminine principle of pause and rest and restoration before taking action. The action's gonna take care of itself today, kids. Have at it.